Do you want it back? No. You have terrifying witch fingers, missus. <laughs> that being said, if you want to meet me in the bathroom, I'm not exactly opposed to that. Oh, 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 hey, no. I was just picking something up. There was something on the ground, and I'm arrested. What is this, China? What's up guys, welcome to I Just Want to Sleep for a While, a game that I don't really know anything about. It's only got like a thousand downloads on the Play Store, which is nothing. Like, nobody is playing this game, but it, it speaks to me. But I just want to sleep for a while. That and the small detail and that the protagonist looks exactly like me. Okay, it's freaking me out. I, I know, I'm a little hard up for a haircut right now, but this would normally be the spitting image of me. The hair, the pasty white skin that never sees the sun, the dark bags under the eyes, and the look of self-defeat on his face. <laughs> the beard! He's not even wearing pants! Like, I don't know whether to play this game or feel attacked. Or both. The protagonist needs to rest within the dashed frame, but first, let the environment inside the dashed frame become suitable for people to rest. Like, it's even a poorly translated Japanese game. I kind of wanted to make my own mobile game someday, but they clearly beat me to the punch. <laughs> it's just checking off every single box in my list, I can't believe it. So I'm guessing we need to, yeah, get some props, okay, so we've got a broom, we've got blankets all right so we will prepare the area within the dashed frame and then sleep on the side of the road you think that the similarities end there but if you don't like this video that very well could end up being me i don't like the fact that they tell me where i need to sleep like i should have sleeping creativity right i'm my own man if i want to crawl up a tree and build a nest then i should be able to <laughs> i shouldn't have to deal with Picking up individual leaves. Just a couple though, we don't need all the rest of them, and uh... Dumpling? Probably should not be eating park dumplings, and we probably can't sleep on a park dumpling either. I don't think I'm gonna be able to sleep on a couple of leaves. Oh no, okay, we can just put them over our eyes and freeze to death. Okay. So we've got leaves, and we've got a dumpling, and that is all I'm seeing right now. I don't think that I can turn this dog into a blanket. <laughs> Would you like a dumpling? Oh, we just... Oh! Okay. He brought me clue. The dog bartering system in this place is very strange. Can we glue together a bunch of leaves? Ah, okay, and we can make ourselves a gluey leaf blanket. <laughs> At least the dog is gonna watch over me? I just walked up to this lady to ask if I could use their bathroom. Take a shower in their sink, but she handed me a fox ball, I assume? Do you want it back? No, you have terrifying witch fingers, missus. <laughs> that being said, if you want to meet me in the bathroom, I'm not exactly opposed to that. Oh, 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 hey, no, I was just picking something up. There was something on the ground and I'm arrested. What is this, China? The last laugh is gonna be on you, lady. Okay, when I get arrested, I just get to spend a couple of days indoors with free food and a bed, it's great. Now I'm gonna go take a shit in your sink. <laughs> I don't need a shower anymore, this looks like a bath room, right? Oh, you don't want a shitty sink? You're too good for that? Well, that's too... Ah, hello, officer. The cops are quick here. What am I supposed to do with your fox ball if I don't even understand what it is? Like, I just don't get it. Uh, I can't read that. Okay, I think we got a business card or something like that. Uh, do you want this? Okay, I put it over there for whatever that's worth. <laughs> that doesn't help me at all. I don't want to go for the ticket. I gotta do something with this, right? Can you go there? No. Can you go in the garbage? No. What if I throw you at the ticket that I was... That's a dog butthole. Oh! It was just, it was just an animal. And they didn't bother giving it ears and put it in a ball. They take Pokemon way too seriously over there. <laughs> Alright, we got, uh... A hundred. 
an IOU for a hundred bucks? Is this money? Can I give this to you? I gave that to you when you gave me back the thing that I gave you. Um, that's not good. I'm super confused right now. <gasps> what is going on? I feel like something is being lost in translation right now. <laughs> Can I go in here now? Oh! Okay, so I paid for a room in a hotel. I get it now. I completely spaced out on the fact that we're trying to find a place to sleep. Like, I got so wrapped up in trying to hook up with this lady and take a crap in her sink and not get arrested and, and the fox dog butthole ball, which is uh, apparently back. <laughs> so now we are in some kind of subway station, I would imagine. How you doing, Skinny? Let me guess, that's your bed. And I want your bed. Okay. Oh, okay, I got my own space for a bed. Maybe I can just, uh, nope. Can't bend my knees. I am wearing a lovely crop top today, though. <laughs> so, can I get you to get it for me? I doubt it. You don't look like the kind to have mad hops. What if I just get you to kill this guy, right? I choose you. Fox it, you. No. That's disappointing. Uh, oh. What if I get you to go in here and then come out the other side and hand me... No, you handed me something else. What is this? What is this? Is it a brick? Can I just bludgeon him to death? No! Oh! Oh, it is a brick! I tried to bludgeon him to death! So Foxachu can head in there and get me a brick, but I don't want to bludgeon him to death with it. That is disappointing. I don't suppose I can toss it in... There, or maybe I can use it as like a stepping stone. There we go, not quite. Still not tall enough. I uh, don't suppose you could send your little pooper in there again and get me another one? Thank you very much. Okay, just keep stacking them up and eventually I'm gonna be able to reach myself a blanket. <laughs> That's gotta be good enough, right? I'm, I'm technically Good enough, okay? I, I didn't get as good a bed as that guy, but he's got to sleep eventually, and then those bricks will come in handy. Unsurprisingly, this game is getting weirder and weirder. It looks like now I want to sleep next to a uh, public pool or a dock, maybe? I'm not entirely sure. That should be all I need, though, right? We could just... We're good to... Oh! Oh! Hmm. Well, that's unfortunate. It's getting crushed in my sleep. I was gonna bludgeon that other guy with bricks. So we know how to fall asleep. That's easy enough. We just need to make sure that all of this crap doesn't fall on us. We can take the one screw that was holding the entire wall together, all right. <laughs> and then maybe just clean all of this up. Oh, oh, what? What happened to my body just then? I, I look like Popeye, except instead of eating the spinach, he used it as a suppository. It feels like we should have this figured out now, right? I just need to make sure that I have everything fall beforehand. Good. We clean you up and make ourselves, uh, brick turds. Okay. I still have no idea why I need any of this stuff. Can't I just sleep there now? Is anything gonna fall on me? No! We just get a couple of spare items. We'll sell that at the pawn shop later. Oh yeah, sleeping on the ground in the middle of the woods. I'm sure this won't end terribly for us. <laughs> We've got ourselves an axe for self-defense. Maybe I can use that to cut down some trees, fashion myself a bed? No. Can I at least chop up the boat? Oh, okay, yeah. We can chop up the boat and get nothing but a single screw that was holding it all together again. Oh, oh no, never mind. And some boards. Very good. So I guess we'll just build ourselves a wooden tent. Didn't see that coming. <laughs> it's almost like a manger. I could just crawl in and, and sleep maybe. Oh, no, mm, no. Can't stop mosquitoes with an axe. How am I supposed to stop a mosquito from coming into my wooden tent? That doesn't make any sense at all. I can't pick up any of these turds. No rocks. Uh, 
Can I take... Oh, yeah, okay, here we go. We might be able to take some vines. That's a snake. Guaranteed that's a snake. So we're not going to take that one. We will take our axe. <laughs> chop up the boat. Good. And then we'll make ourselves our little hut. And then use this to... That's not going to stop a mosquito at all. Right? How is that supposed to stop a... Are they afraid of vines? Whatever, man, as long as I got to sleep without contracting Ebola or whatever mosquitoes are passing around these days. You see, that is how you stop a mosquito. Nature knows best. We should just sleep behind that. As long as there isn't a giant spider around here. Okay, maybe we'll just take this for self-defense anyway. Could chop down some bamboo. Okay, okay, we got ourselves some defensive spikes. Maybe we could use these to move the net aside. Yeah, just give that a little bit. Okay. Yep. That would be a spider the size of a golden retriever. So how exactly do I beat the spider with a couple of punji sticks? I really doubt I can dig a pit and make him fall in. And I used my axe. Can I use these things here? Oh, interesting. So now we can poke it with fire and we found a bear. I don't trust the bear. I could hug him, but I think I would rather stab him. Yeah, back up bear. Oh, oh, right. They love bamboo. I, I wasn't stabbing him. I was giving him a snack. So now we should be able to sleep in there with him. Okay, I'm not gonna judge. Am I losing my mind, or is this telling me that I need to sleep in an underground river? <laughs> I don't think that's gonna end particularly well. We've got a pile of dirt, a bigger pile of dirt that I can use as a dam. Okay, so maybe we can use you to fashion some kind of mud pillow? No? Okay, then. Uh... We just turned a bunch of moss into a blanket. Can I use that? Yeah, all right, we've got a bit of a problem. Just a small one. As you can probably tell from my lack of shoes, I'm not a doctor, but that stalag might have killed me. <laughs> or stalag tight have killed me. I'm not a geologist either, okay? Don't worry about it. We're just gonna chuck this rock up there to loosen it, and then hopefully I can get a little rest there we go. <laughs> Head perfectly intact. We gotta keep the moneymaker safe. There's a lot to absorb on screen right now. <gasps> We've got a tree that seems to be peeking at the world's crappiest alligator, and then a real thick camouflaged individual. Are you man? Are you woman? I really need to know before I start pinching this bum. Hello? I'm super confused right now. Nothing is working. Oh, it's a hunter. Oh, okay. All right. So why don't I just go sleep in your tent? Oh, oh, okay. Good news, it's a woman. Bad news, she shot me in the face. So we need to convince the extra thick hunter to let us sleep in her tent and maybe get her to sleep in the tent with us. You never know, you can always shoot for the moon. Or at the very least, the crappy looking alligator. What would happen if I use the purse in the tent? Nothing? Okay. What if I shoot you? No. What if I give you your purse? No. Can I shoot what's in the tree? Can I give the purse to what's in the tree? I am so confused right now. What if I give you the purse? Because it looks like an alligator skin purse, right? Oh, oh, he's sad. And now he's mad. And now he's eating her. Should I save her? I kinda wanna save, oh, I can't save her. Okay, uh, still not really sure what's going on in this tree. Doesn't seem to be anything I could do about that. Uh, sorry, lady, I'm, I'm just gonna go take a nap now. I could do that, right, because you're dead. We've got the Game of Thrones, and I'm guessing if I even think about sitting on that throne, you two are gonna tear me apart. So we'll just avoid that and move over towards the Lucky Tree. What would be waiting in the Lucky 
tree. Okay, that... That's not exactly the ass I was hoping for. I'll be right back. I just gotta try that again. Except for this time, I need to use my luck. Of course! Right, because now we get a crown. And you have to let me on the throne. Because... I have a crown. I have a crown? No. You want a crown? Oh. Okay. So now you have a crown. And you tore up my blanket. Oh no, I need my blanket to sleep! I can't go up the tree, I'll get hit by a donkey. I can't blow the tree over because the crown is useless. Can I use this on one of you idiots? What if I just give you a blow and there we go, then maybe... Maybe I can convince you to give him a blow in and then I can just slip on past. <laughs> I didn't think I'd be playing line matchmaker this morning, okay? So we've got our bedroll and we have a desert tornado. <gasps> Perfect opportunity to take a nap. I just need to get my holy goblet and then throw it at the tornado, okay. Uh, the goblet is gonna give me either a genie or a bed and a wall. I would much rather just take a nap, right? Wall should, uh, do nothing against a tornado. Okay, that's fair. So instead, we will ask for a genie, and then we will use the genie to wish for no tornado. And there you have it, the tor- Freaking genie, man. <laughs> Every time they get the opportunity to screw with you. We'll get the goblet. We'll throw the goblet into the tornado. We'll get a genie. Then we'll use the genie to wish for dragon balls. And then we'll use the dragon balls to wish for a goblet again? Or a female tornado? And then they'll run off to make little tornado babies and ravage the world as I finally take a nap? Thank God. <laughs> Man, this game. And of course the final level would have us at the bottom of the sea. With a beautiful naked woman. Okay, pleasantly surprised. May I join you? No, okay, again, it's not telling me where I should be sleeping. Should I take your clothes? I'm gonna take your clothes. That seems to have upset her. I can give you a blanket in return. Okay. Well, mm, well. Oh, I was going to say that ended a lot better than I could have hoped for, but <laughs> I didn't get to sleep anyway. Really? That's that's it. <laughs> Whatever. This was good. You know what, I think that's gonna be it for this episode of I Just Want to Sleep for a While, guys. I didn't play through all of the levels, technically. I skipped over a few of them because I just can't fit 30 levels into one episode. But if you guys wanna see me return and play through all the stuff that I've missed, then be sure to leave a like in the video, let me know, and then maybe I'll return for more poorly translated Japanese hilarity soon. But thanks so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time.